And we're going to be targeting our fish species of Michigan again. I picked up a new Whopper Plopper, brand new. I had trouble figuring out which one I wanted to buy. But tonight we're going after the largemouth bass, the smallmouth bass, and the spotted bass. There are some big fat mama bass out here. Guys, I have a really good feeling. Let's get to the water, go catch them. But before we go fishing here, we're going to give you the verse of the day. John 8, 12. On Jesus spoke to them and he said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will not be in darkness, but will have the light of life. So that's the verse of the day, guys. Let's go catch some big, huge fish on God's country. Small fella, what is he? All right, guys, he's pretty small. Whoa, and he's feisty. Oh, and these trebles are razor blades, brand new Whopper Plopper with the razors. Hold on, guys. That's why I brought these. Especially with the freaking triple barb. There he is, a little small fry. You do not want one of these barbs going in your freaking finger, guys. All right guys, he might be small, but this is actually, believe it or not, I've always thought that these were largemouth bass, which they basically are in my book, but it's actually a spotted bass, and he's super tiny, and I believe we're gonna catch a few more nice ones tonight. He's got some little battle scars on him. I don't know if that was from tonight, but he's a feisty little fellow. Let's get him back in the water. So brand new species, guys. We're up to six now, six species. You'll find out what six they are, but trust me, that's a new species. Oh, oh. I want to get like, oh, I remember that's what I was talking. Oh my goodness, another rock bass. Look at that, an unexpected catch, a little smaller than last time. And it could actually be a warmouth. After looking at that little book, there's rock bass and then there's warmouth. Let's get a look at them, guys. What a nice little beauty. About the size of my hand. What a nice little healthy fish. What's that on him? It's got a little spot on him. See the red eyeballs? So, we're gonna let him go. 10 points. So I was swimming here the other day, in the same spot, I was swimming underwater. A big, huge patch of them. And there was rock bass, largemouth, smallmouth, spotted bass. Got another one, just another small one. So they're hitting tonight, guys. The little ones kind of are up on the top sticks, and the big fatties are at the bottom sticks. So I'm hoping later in the evening, the big boys, the big boys are gonna get a little bit more hungry than these guys. I am not losing a $15 lure again, guys. Here we go, guys. This is the layer. This is the spot right here. Oh, did you see how another little fish just hit it? Oh, they hit it again. What did I tell you, guys? Come on, it's getting suspenseful, dude. It's getting suspenseful. So, rule of thumb is you go fishing before the storm, fish bite really active, they're really active before a storm, and the day after the storm, it's not, they're not really so, not really too hungry. But I wanna work in like this close to the freaking shore, that's where you get the biggest strikes. Just like that, and the big baddies sit underneath there. That's a fish right there, bam. Oh yeah, guaranteed. Bam, told you guys. Oh, he got off. He got off, he got off. Really long cast, and I wasn't really expecting it. Got another one. Oh, it's a decent little fish. Oh, it's another small freaking rock bass. Guys, what the heck do we got here? Three freaking rock bass. This is the same freaking fish every time. What is going on here? Settle yourself. Let me get out the pinchers. Dude, I'm trying to help you. <gasps> All right, guys, we got him. Here we go. Perfect. Calabunga, that's a fish. Amen. There we go. Here we go. Bam. A little jiggly wiggly. I blame the speed of the river. 
We got one. A nice bass. I think this is a new species, guys. He's so tiny, we can whip him right in here. Oh, kind of small. Yikes, I knew he was gonna do that. Oh, whoa, whoa, guys. All right, guys, this is an actual largemouth. Another species. Oh, my goodness. This is an actual largemouth, not a spotted bass. So do you see how he doesn't have that distinct stripe like the other one? He's just solid green. And this is a, still a young baby one, so he's pretty light. But they just get, this is a legit large mouth. Look at that. Wow, so he's mainly one solid color on top, and he fades to kind of green, just dark green to light green. The shape is almost identical to the spotted bass. Ooh, I was just gonna give him some I was going to say oxygen, I guess that's right. Oxygen is true, but... Another species down, that's number seven. So we did catch another species, not the size we were looking for, but there's still more fish in here and we have a, we still have a little bit more daylight, so let's... <laughs> Bless you, camera girl. <laughs> Big shout out to Miss Bonnie for also being the best camera girl, because without her, you guys wouldn't be getting these sick freaking angles. Hey, that was the first largemouth that kind of slammed it. It was small, but we're gonna work ourselves up back to freaking Darla's tent house and get one. Get freaking big fat Darla. When that big dogfish snapped my other Whopper Popper off, I had a white one just like this, freaking sucked it up. Broke it right off, right at the bank. I had nine pound test. Come on, quick. We don't have much daylight. Hey, the geese are coming in. They're telling me to go home, get out of their freaking home. They're saying, you can't go home, you just can't stay here. They're basically telling me. But thanks for watching. You guys have a blessed night. Stay safe out there, wherever you guys are. You could be getting shot at over in the Middle East, but we are lucky to live in America where we can go fishing and love one another. Just as the Lord has loved you. So, also, if you're still listening, I'm gonna go with my GoPro on one of these sunny days. I'm gonna go into these same spots and I'm gonna show you how big these fish are. I'm literally gonna show you how big these fat bass are. So, if you like that, I could care less or not, but subscribe and have a blessed night. Jesus loves you.